chicka wow wow. My name is Steve Springstead and I'm here to help you face the book. I just returned from a trip to Cuba. We've all heard stories about Cuba, what it was like, and what we, you know, we hear that it's really oppressed and all those kinds of things. And it is, it genuinely is tough and difficult there. What was amazing though, was seeing God work in the midst of all of this oppression, in the midst of all the challenges they have. And that sort of tied in with the scriptures that I was reading this morning. And from uh, Matthew chapter 24, Jesus has just uh, been on at the temple with the disciples. And while he was there, he said, all of these stones, it's all going to come down. And then he began to talk about the things about the sign of his coming and the end of the age. And in verse 6 and following, he talks about wars and rumors of wars that you're going to hear about, earthquakes, all these difficult things. And then he makes this statement, see that you are not frightened. And I was thinking about that this morning, that the number one reason why often that we don't share the good news with others is because we're afraid. And, and on that island there, I saw bold, bold Cubans who were just taking the scriptures, taking the gospel all over the island, amazing things that were happening. As a matter of fact, in our little ragtag group that we had there, we had the chance to share the gospel over and over, and God did amazing things through us. And so he talks about this in the last verse, verse 14, this gospel of the kingdom shall be preached in the whole world. So in the midst of all the stuff that's going on, God says, don't be frightened keep going, this gospel is going to go forth.